Hey everybody, blessings and welcome once again to For His Glory Couponing with a Purpose. Today I'm going to share a couple of deals that I did at Walgreens. We have some great deals on the Axe products and a good deal on PNG products overall. So let's get started. I had a digital booster still for the $10 in Walgreens cash when you spend $30 and that was expiring today. So I needed to make a quick run to the Walgreens. I ended up doing the PNG deal that a lot of people are doing and I decided to throw the ax in as well because that was going to get me to the $30 for my digital booster. So the ax this week is on sale. Buy one, get one 50% off. So I picked up one at regular price of $5.49 and the other at half price at $2.74. The total of these two together is $8.23 and we have a $5 digital coupon on the Walgreens app, which is gonna bring that down to $3.23. We also have a rebate on Ibotta for $3 off of each body wash. And for Fetch, I didn't have anything for this body wash. I thought I did. I thought I had a $2 or one dollar but when i submitted my receipt i only got some change for it like maybe 68 points which is only six cents but for each of them but in any event then i ended up picking up the head and shoulders those are on sale for six dollars two for twelve and we have a digital coupon on the app for three dollars off two then i picked up three of the crest toothpaste at four dollars a piece for a total of twelve dollars and used a five off three digital coupon on the app to bring that down to seven dollars i forgot to mention the head and shoulders has a reward of a three dollar register reward when you buy two and then the press toothpaste has a five dollar register reward when you buy three so together the head and shoulders and the crest toothpaste totals 24 dollars we have a promotion with png that you get a four dollar png register reward and it is a manufacturer register reward when you spend twenty dollars my transaction total altogether was thirty two dollars and twenty three cents the five dollar digital came off for the axe the five dollar digital came off for the crest and a three dollar digital came off for the head and shoulders my total was 1923 and with a dollar 20 in tax it came out to twenty dollars and 43 cents i paid that with my paypal debit card which has a lot of my rebate money on there and what i got back was ten dollars in walgreens cash for my spend 30 32 cents for uh, everyday points. I also got back the $4 register reward for spending 20 on P&G. I got a $3 register reward for buying the two head and shoulders. And then I got the $5 coupon, I'm sorry, the $5 register reward for buying the three Crest toothpaste. So my cost for the transaction was $20.43, and I got a total of $22.39 back in rewards because I had actually seven cents from Fetch. Yeah, that was really low. Big mistake there, but it still came out to be a good deal, and that made this transaction free, and a dollar 96 money maker i did not submit the axe to ibotta because i was going to submit it to my son's account because as you'll see with the next transaction that i purchased four more bottles and the limit is five and it wasn't showing on his account anymore so again it was still free and a one dollar and 96 cents money maker and I'm going to show you the receipt. All right, so there you see the two Axe products, buy one, get one half, $12 for the two head and shoulders, $12 for the three crests. Digital coupons, five, five, and three, subtotal 1923, and 
2043 with the tax. Then you see the register rewards that I got, the four P and G, $3 head and shoulders, $5 crest for that total of $22.39. I forgot to take a picture of the side of the receipt showing the $10.32 in Walgreens cash. And someday I'll get better at taking photos to input like the fetch and all of that. But $22.39, really great. Let's go on to deal number two. Okay, so here you see, I picked up the ax again and those were buy one, get one half. 549 for one, 274 for the other. Two of them come out to $8.23. And all four together were $16.46. On this one, I had a $4 digital coupon, but I also have $4 paper coupons from the save from Sunday, which was April 2nd, $4 off two. There was also two fifty off one, but those were on the fine fragrance products. Then I picked up two of the L'Oreal L5, and these were $5.49 each. We have a $4 off two digital coupon, a $2 off two IVC, and there was also a $3 off two instant coupon. That I wasn't sure if it was going to come off when I hit the um, coupon to see the details. It just showed me the L'Oreal products. So I gave it a shot anyway, because I wanted to be able to use $10 in Walgreens cash after all of my coupons. So the total of all these products was $27.45. After the $2 IVC, it was $25. 45 and remember the ivc lowers the actual price of the item so you don't see it on the bottom of your receipt as a coupon you see it where the actual item is it will say ivc and then the amount so that was one dollar off of each one then my digital coupon of four off two came off and then a four off two paper coupon for the axe products and then the $4 off two for the L'Oreal, as well as the $2 off two IVC that I mentioned coming off earlier. The $3 off two did not come off. He tried doing it again with a, um, a lead or assistant manager came over. They were trying to help me get that extra deal, but it came to mind that maybe it was online only. So after the coupons and IVC coming off, my total came down to $13.44 with $0.84 cents in tax for a total of $14.28. I told them I'll just reach out to customer service. I did try to use the chat feature. I did try to use the chat feature, but it was a little late, so I'm going to have to do that tomorrow. I used $10 in Walgreens cash to pay, and then I paid the $4.28 with my PayPal debit card. And this should have been $11.28 using 10 in Walgreens cash and $1.28 out of my pocket. So what I got back was I submitted my receipt to Ibotta and I got $12.75. I had a 75 cent and a receipt surprisingly for Walgreens account. And then I got $3 for each of the body wash products. I got 19 cents from Fetch and 15 cents in Walgreens cash for a total back of $13.09 in rewards. Deducting that from the $14.28 that I paid would make the cost of all six products $1.19 or 19 cents each. If I'm able to get back the $3 from customer care because of the lack of clarity on the coupon, then my cost would be $11.28 minus $13.09 back in rewards would make it all free and a $1.81 money maker. Oh, and let me show you the receipt for this transaction. All right, so there you see four of the acts on top. 549, 274, 549, 274, L'Oreal LV, 549 minus $1 store IVC, 
and 549 minus one dollar store ivc and then we have the four dollar paper coupon for the axe the four dollar off two digital for the axe and the four dollar off two for the l'oreal bringing my total down to 13.44 plus 84 cents tax for a total of 14.28 and a dollar nineteen after rewards, or a dollar eighty one money maker after the three dollar coupon is reimbursed for me, hopefully. And either way, it's a really great deal, no matter how you look at it. Now, if we were to look at the two transactions together, because transaction one was a dollar and ninety six cent money maker. And transaction two right now has cost me a dollar nineteen. This is still all free and a seventy seven cent money maker. If customer service gives me three dollars back in Walgreens cash for that instant coupon that didn't come off, then this will be completely free and a three dollar and seventy cent money maker. So either way, I am pleased and I will take that deal. Well, guys, that's all that I have for this video. Thank you for taking the time to stop and watch. I appreciate you. If you enjoyed the video or found it useful or helpful in any sort of way, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to help me to continue to grow here on the YouTube platform. That being said, be blessed and I'll catch you on the next one.